the final hurdle race of Trials Day 2, then he's over two miles and six furlongs. Urquhart for Alex Cherry, Live in the Moment for D. Hooley, Redwood Edition for David Robertson, Casalero del Diablo for Derek Hinson, World in White Hands, Joshua Sutherland, I Love My Brick, Kevin Meenahan, Count Solution, Martin Liddham, St. Jude, Paul Rhodes, Mighty Black, Graham Clutterbuck, Autumnal Toujours, Darren Thompson, Raffaella Milet, Craig Allen, Zep Novell, Jim Murray, God of the Mind, Leon Van Rensburg, Blon, Ryan Costello and Trud Blur for Ryan Tamasi, but they're already racing down towards the first of the flights and live in the moment. He's in the lead by about a length to Casarel do Del Diablo. Uh, in second place, so one or two people have got some interesting named horses in this. Let's hope they don't do very well and they don't make the league team and I don't have to call them out every week. They live in the moments in the lead then. <laughs> Castellarello del. Well, I'll just do what Doug would do. Doug would just call that Derek's horse and be done with it, wouldn't he? So it's live in the moment in the lead and Castellaro del Diablo is second and God of the Mind is third then St Jude and Zep Novell Urquhart's after that one an autumnal toujours and towards the back Redwood edition it's just about the back marker for David Robertson but it's living the moment in front for D Hooley who's having a pretty good day today in this trials day two and then skip over flight number two which they're all safely over and Castellaro del Diablo is still there in second. God of the Mind is third. Autumnal Toujours, Urquhart, Zep Novell. Got some good names in this as they take the third. And they're all over that one safely as well. With Blonde and Redwood Edition, the back pair, Raphael and Mylette also towards the back. As they make their way towards the next, it'll be the last on the next circuit, which they're all over. Bit of a Skatey sort of landing for Count Solution at the back though. Didn't jump in at all well and has been relegated to back spot as they pass the winning post with a circuit to go. And live in the moment in the lead. Swinging left handed leads by three to Casadero del Diablo in second. Gap of a couple then to God of the Mind in third and Mighty Black and Zep Novell and St. Jude. We tightly pat the main body of the field, the leading pair. Uh, a few lengths ahead of them though, living in the moment, two lengths clear of Castro del Diablo, who's a similar distance ahead of the pack, who are headed by God of the Mind. The one struggling out the back is Count Solution. Oh, I love my brick, is also struggling out the back a little bit. Let me get Kevin Meenahan to tell us where he got that name from. Another interesting looking one. But live in the moment is the leader. As they get down to the sixth, which they all get over okay, including the back market. Count Solution, but it's living the moment who's in the lead. From Casadero del Diablo, who's now being joined by God of the Mind. St. Jude is fourth. They skip over the seventh, which they're all safely over. I don't think we've seen a faller over the hurdles today. And uh, living the moment is in front. Has been all the way. sure when the league's due to start November I think somebody said so there's still time to tweak your teams and improve and don't quite know what is the best result really whether you best have had one winner and nothing else which is what I've had so far or whether you're better off having lots of sort of fourth fifth sixth and knowing that you're thereabouts all the time so everybody make their own judgment of what they've got what they need to improve on and whatever Maybe talk more about that in the four mile race that's coming up to end the day. Uh, Living the moment is in the lead from God of the Mind in second. Castillo del Diablo is after that one as they take flight number eight. I think we can safely say that Urquhart and Count Solution are not going to play much of a part in the finish unless they absolutely sprout wings. But it's Living the Moment in front. God of the Mind. St. Jude, Mighty Black Autumnal Toujours is making a forward move as well. Castro del Diablo is now beginning to drop away. I've seen too many greys today. There's normally quite a few greys in the fields in these SO7 races, but well, most races only had one or two. As they come down towards the third from home and live in the moment, is still in front. It's been in the lead all the way, but Rafaela Milet 
is now throwing down a big challenge in second. Gone on the mind is third. St. Jude is next in. Zep Novell is getting much closer. The one grey in the race. World in White Hands is getting closer. So they skip over to third last. And Raphael Amalette has now gone on from living the moment second. God of the mind now running around again in third. Then Zep Novell. World in White Hands is getting closer. Then St. Jude and Redwood Edition. Nothing else is in it as they race down towards the second last. Then there. And Raphael Amalette has gone three or four clear. And it might well be nothing else in it by that one. As they race down towards the final flight. But Raphael Amalette looks like it might be stopping. Here comes World in White Hands. Living the moment. He's trying to battle back. They go to the final flight then and Raphael Amalek gets over it nicely in the lead probably just about far enough clear there's still got about a quarter of a fight on to go by racing up towards the line and Raphael Amalek is going to take it from World in White Hands is going to hold on for second then Redwood Edition giving the moment Zep Novell and Goddard Amalek and Trode Blur who didn't really get into it and the last one to finish might want to be Alex Cherries and it's another one for Craig Allen I think Look, he might be the one to throw down a big challenge to Leon this season. Let's take a look. It's Raphael Amalette takes it for Craig Allen. World in white hands for Joshua Sutherland second. And D. Hooley was fourth again there. So Redwood Edition was third for David Robertson. Living the moment for D. Hooley fourth. And Zep Novell for Jim Murray was fifth.